Hi guys and welcome back to another Tuesday 2 minute tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can create this solid colour effect in Photoshop. And I'm going to start right now. So the first thing you want to do guys is go ahead and choose a photo. And today I've chosen this photo which again I got from unsplash.com. After you've done that, what you want to do is think of the colour that will complement the photo the best. So for instance in this image, as you can see I've got a lovely photo of an iceberg. So obviously what I'm going to do is choose a lovely blue colour. So what you want to do is go down to our adjustment layers icon and you want to go up to the very top where you can see it says solid colour. Once you've chosen solid colour, either you can use the colour picker tool or what you can do is just simply choose a colour that you think will be best in the solid color layer here. So I'm gonna choose a kind of like a very cyan blue like so. Once you've done that, you will need to change the blending mode. Now you can go ahead, go to our blending mode options and you can either go to any of these blending modes here. So you've got overlay, soft light, hard light, vivid light, linear light, pin light and hard mix. These are all overlay blending modes where that if you change the fill, which is the projection, it will actually change how the colour reacts to the photo beneath it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and select vivid light, so it's very, very bright. But what you'll need to do is just simply change the fill, and I'm going to change the fill to around 25%. And as you can see, it has added a lovely tint to this photo to really add drama and add a colour to your photo. So what I can do is leave before and after, and wow, what a difference. And there we go guys, 